When we pray, there's a God who hears us. When we pray. Hello, my name is Donna Jimenez and I am a small business owner here in Brighton, Colorado in the United States. And I just want to share uh, over the last few years that I've been connected to this platform, I have to say that I, um, the prayers, the words, the, the intensity, the everything about it, it has changed my life. Um, I never knew that we could pray for certain things, the scripture that is attached to it, the power, the intensity, the, you know, the discipline and, and knowing that no matter what is going on in your life, whether it's divorce, whether it's financial, whether it's grief, grief, whether it's loss, uh, it, you know, it doesn't matter because, you know, when you connect to this platform, we're all together, we're all encouraged, we're all, you know, searching seeking God in, in, in all of this and you know PPH I am I can't even explain to you how grateful I am how thankful I am that I am able to connect and you know if you haven't shared with a friend if you haven't shared with a family please please do so um, this is beyond anything that we see especially here in the United States um, you know where we can come together consistently i mean a thousand days of prayer i mean who does that you know and here we are we're able to connect out of you know the comfort of our home and and you know on the days when you don't want to pray you don't know what to pray you're confused you're you don't know and you connect and you just you just kind of melt in right into this you know this prayer flow if you will and you know I, i'm just i'm so thankful i you know this 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 program has come in, you know, just when I need it, just on time, every single time. Um, and just knowing that, you know, no matter what's going on, we can connect, we can learn, we can grow together. And um, it's just a beautiful thing. And I am very grateful and I'm grateful for each and every one of you, Reverend Sam, Mama Mary, you, you're just the best. And, you know, no matter what is going on, Remember, with our God, all things are possible. My name is Queen Glenda. I'm uh, speaking from Orlando, Florida. And I want to say congratulations, everyone around the world, for the 1,000 days of the Prophetic Prayer Hour. It is such a blessing. I give God the glory for the time and the many days of prayer and intercession. I joined uh, the PPH about two, or two weeks after they had got off the ground <laughs> and while I was living in Texas and going through a challenging time and God knew what I needed and he provided the prophetic prayer hour. It was just a blessing. I've seen the prophetic prayer hour grow. The media team, um, the guest speakers that they have to come in, as well as the music and now the anthem. So we're just, you know, blessed um, by that. Pastor Sam, Pastor Mommy uh, Oye, and the Transformation Church, Pastor Shagan, everybody involved. Uh, uh, around the nation, bless God for you. You know, uh, where there's a people to pray, there's a God who answers. And with our God, all things are possible. My name is Aisha and I am testifying from Montreal, Canada. I came across BPH back in October of 2021. Um, it was honestly one of the darkest time of my life. I was depressed, anxious, you name it. When I came across BPH, I felt peace, I felt at home and sometimes last year I knew that God wanted me to start my food business because I'm a firm believer that God speaks to us through uh, different mediums, you know, through people and um, I wanted to start but fear, 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 fear and as of October of uh, 2022 I could not even qualify for a five thousand dollars mastercard and i believe in november i had a dream where i was in my house and i'm like you know what maybe god is trying to tell me something because papa will always prophesy you shall be in your own, own, own house i'm like you know what let me do my part and let god do his so 
so I took it upon myself, cleared every debt that was impacting my credit bureau. As of January, we sent in our prayer request. One of my many prayer requests was uh, for God to approve my uh, father's uh, visa application. Put in the application, within two weeks, it was approved. My sibling visa, two weeks after that, it was approved. I started my business. People were just coming to me. Oh, Aisha, do you need help with this? Oh, Aisha, I can, I can, I can do your flyer, your flyers for you. Oh, Aisha, you know, I uh, referred you here. Like God has really blessed the work of my hands, and the food that I make, I always put the blood of Jesus on my food, and the feedbacks that I've been getting are amazing. Like. I am in my little house and like you know, people are like literally telling me that your food is making a wave in town because of the anointing God has placed on my head. And also, um, I my plan has always been to get a mortgage in 2024. So this year, I took it upon myself, you know, to call a realtor. I was like, okay, you know what, let me just, you know, gain some, some, some knowledge in this whole mortgage thing. Papa. <laughs> me that just called just to have information as of right now i have been approved for a whole mortgage three hundred thousand me that could not even get approved for 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 five thousand as of uh, november last year god has been faithful people of pph keep liking keep sharing like i said you don't know who might need it for someone like me suicide was probably going to be my next thought of action but we thank God for PPH. We thank God for Papa. Praise God and greetings from Kenya. My name is Anne Peggy Ashira. I met PPH at 365 days. Reverend Samway had invited Apostle Joshua Salman. And I remember it was my first time to meet both of them. They spoke intensely about scripture being the basis or the boundary of prayer. And um, I have followed uh, PPH since then to see Reverend Sam Oye using scripture as the bill of quantity to get prayers answered and I've had amazing, amazing uh, testimonies. I'd later join the Transformers International School of Ministry and Reverend Sam Oye taught about what is ministry, ministry gifts. And he talked about focus being the pathway to mastery and uh, longevity. And uh, he talked about servant leadership as well. And my and overall experience with PPH has been phenomenal. Uh, Reverend Sam Oye talked about how to complement uh, uh, ministry gifts. And I, I look at how him and Apostle Joshua Selman are giving believers a very solid uh, uh, foundation, a beautiful spiritual architectural design based on uh, scripture. And I'm really, really grateful. During the graduation ceremony for Tisom, Apostle Joshua Salman and Reverend Sam Oye knelt on our prayer request and they declared that the days of looking for a good job are over. Back from that graduation, I just landed my dream job at the right environment, very well matched with my gifts, and I'm very, very excited. Uh, my daughter has suffered trauma for about nine years following the kidnapping and total disappearance of her father. And because of the lack of closure, she was extremely traumatized. And in the place of prayer, I asked the Holy Spirit, what do I do? He asked me to look for a paternal grandmother, and this would be the end of the trauma. And true to it, I found her born again, loving Jesus, and she has been miraculously restored to us. Captivity ended, trauma ended. Thank you to PPH. Thank you to Reverend Sam Oye the global intercessory team where I belong to, to the grace team. Indeed, with our God, all things are possible. Oh,